When people tell me, you've changed, I reply bluntly, yes, I sure hope I have. When I was 15 and trying to find myself, life at first didn't make a whole lot of sense. 16, life seemed like a crushing weight as I tried to be society's spitting image. 17, life felt like daggers. Sharp, sharp edges blocked the words in my throat. I could never say what I needed to. 18, I'm starting to find some clarity. Yet my development as an individual has never been linear. Rather, I am a scattered plot with a line of best fit that seems straight enough to everyone except myself. I've been the rider of a wave too strong to surf. I've been the navigator of galaxies waiting to be created. And only after I had destroyed the stars around them did they finally become real. I have been two different things in my life. I have been the pieces and I have been the puzzle. As the pieces, I've thought about all the places I could end up constantly trying to figure out where I belong in the world. I've gone from thinking my place was in a boy's arms to the universe's grasp, to the fixer of hearts, a mender of souls, a grantor of wishes. Every piece of me revolves around my labor for others. As a pieces, I've known where I should end up, yet many times I am lost in the search for others to complete me. I latch onto them thinking they fit me, and when they don't, they always leave small gaps between us. As the pieces, I've found myself isolated, like lost pieces cluttered in an attic under spider webs and dust bunnies, forgotten in the pocket of your favorite jeans, accidentally washed. My paper pieces crumbling into illegible nothingness, melted like chapstick in a dryer, sometimes lost under dining room tables, often overlooked because everyone looks for the puzzle. But then I became the puzzle, sometimes still without a few pieces, but the missing pieces have been filled in with proof that life gets better. As the puzzle, I've reached destinations I didn't think I could find. As the puzzle, I have been the whole, no longer separate from my friends, my family, or myself. I have been the pieces drifting together once more. So when you tell me I have changed, I will always say, why, yes, I have. My body is no longer covered in wilting flowers. It is now growing the seeds I finally watered. My eyes are shining like sunbeams. My head is rising like balloons slipped loose from flimsy fingers. I have changed, but only because I needed to.